Hello, how's it going? Welcome back to some more Top Spin for and another part of our career mode. Today, I thought we'd take on Stan Vavrinka and Roger Federer. We'd do both matches in one episode. I was going to skip forward, but what happens if this match was an absolute classic? So I thought we've got to get it on camera, everybody. Yeah. Leave a like if you enjoy, and I know you do enjoy the, the slightly longer videos as well. So we'll maybe do that at two matches a an episode now until the end um obviously that won't really be possible in the australian open but uh, we'll give it a go right well we'll skip through the uh introductions because um it'll just be the same as what we had in the group stage but here we go best of three once again against stan and uh let's get into it Obviously, in our first match, oh. I'll serve on the, the juice court and our forehand in particular were very, very strong against uh, Davidenko. So, if we can continue that good form today, then that would really help. And because Stan, you know, isn't as quick out there as a Davidenko, he, he could really struggle. That was a very good forehand, by the way. Right on the line. is uh, a very positive start against Stan shot yeah well there it is if we keep that up for the rest of the match it could be very very one-sided he almost fell over there didn't he Too late on that one. Yeah, this is very good. Very good start. Just the two points lost in those opening three games. So it could be quite a quick one here. This time Stan's really been in a a game. But yeah, his, his backhand isn't firing, is it? Forehand seems to be in pretty good shape. But really for Stan to be a threat, he, he needs his backhand to be at its elite best. Yeah, 
That was okay. Didn't have a lot of power behind it though. Good start to the service game. We just didn't play that well enough, did we? Very good. Nicely played. 4-1, we race into the lead of. Yeah, there we go, another brilliant forehand down the line. 20th winner of the match already. Oh, that just caught the line. That was close. Three break points. Beautiful return. And there we go. Yeah, Stan already going to be a set down here. This is pretty impressive so far. And that's the thing, as we've said before, with Stan. Oh, lovely shot. Oh, what a shot that is. How did we win that point? He's a very streaky player, is Stan. That's what I was going to say. And unless he's streaking, he's struggling. And that was you know, another nine points in a row. Well, he was already walking to his seat there. He thought that was in. And there it is. There's the first set then. 6 1. Very, very impressive. Yeah, um, we're just playing around the court with him here.
shot. Again, another streak of points won by us there. Shot, lovely. That could be the backhand that turns this match. Just a little bit. He's just his movement doesn't seem to be quite there. Oh, we're not gonna get there. It's wide. And here we go. Break point. Shot. Very nice. Well, again, I thought that was headed out, but it drops in again. played long rally that one 20 hits in that one again just able to work up these opportunities Lovely little drop volley there. But we do need to make sure that we're not taking this match for granted. Oh my god, just bringing in Stan once again. This is very, very good, and as I said, that backhand just sort of has sprung him 
back into life a little bit. Wow. <laughs> He's not getting that one back, though. Hmm. Is that much more like what you'd expect Stan to play? Just seemed very turgid in the opening set. That's a problem. As soon as he's hitting it short, we are just absolutely obliterating him. I like this approach of a bit more slice in there. Trouble is, two can play at that game. And now we get our first break point of the second set. Oh, it's wide. Well, it looked like a good angle, but it dropped wide. Oh, he's in a huge hole. Oh, he's hit it wide. That's not good. And almost out of the ashes of nothing. We've broken serve. Yeah, this isn't good though. Two break points. I'm just not quite at the same levels of intensity that we were in the first set. You could see he tried to let rip there, didn't he? He knew that was a chance. What a shot, though. There you go. He breaks serve. <laughs> Incredible. Once again. Really, really strong. Oh! 
Yeah, this is a bit of a spell for Stan. That's wide. This isn't very good. Finally, we win that one. Goodness me. I need to regain our focus now. wide <laughs> oh that's a good shot though it's a good one Points come out of relatively nowhere in the set. We've not been playing well, but we get there. Four points away from victory. Well, this could be over very, very quickly here. Just 
timing the ball so well, he says, and then I don't know what he was thinking. But that forehand brings up two match points. And there it is, very, very strong indeed from us. And uh, we are th through the semi-finals with relative ease there. Played well in the end. 6-1, 6-3, and we are gonna go straight into the next match against uh, Roger Federer. So let's uh, use the function. Play next round now. And see what happens. There he is, Roger Federer. Season ranking still number one for, for Roger. He's had a good season. Tricky couple of matches, but... Let's see how we get on against him. I mean, we've absolutely dominated against him um, in recent matches, but we haven't played him since the uh, US Open. And we bageled him in the final set, didn't we? So, good start. That's the thing with Federer, he will be a lot tougher to beat than Stan. But we can dominate him just as much. Just seem to be absolutely cream in the ball. Wow. Feels like it could be quite a short match once we've broken that first game. I mean, he is gonna. Yeah, he is gonna, you know, come back at us, but. Again, he's a, a streaky player, but can be a very. downtrodden player when. Things aren't going his way. strong start
Well, if we come back and win this game, I don't think there's anything that we could do to be stopped. As I say, it's the timing of the ball that's <laughs> impressed me so much. Literally everything is good or, or perfect. And there you go, you know, from 40 love to juice now. Now it's going to be break point, yeah. A servant volley. Not going to work this time. And there it is. Oh, three love. Federer's barely getting a racket on it here. This is how we played against him in the US Open. We surely couldn't bagel him again, could we? I mean, we could do, because it's going to be two break points here. He's just playing very silly tennis. To be completely honest. Gonna reach it? Oh my word, how? <laughs> well, yeah, five love now. This is ridiculous. So, serving for this first set. Three, 
Well, two set points. Well, that was uh, interesting. I don't think I've ever dominated somebody like Federer quite that much before. But yeah, he just wasn't quite playing the right shots and well that's what happens uh, serving and volleying is just not working Actually, win this one. Yeah, well done. So at least it's not going to be a double bagel. Sudden Federer starting to actually play. Nicely done. Well, I don't know where this has come from. <laughs> Well, that's what I mean. He just sort of, when he's a few down, he just sort of plays like he's given up. It's really bizarre. Oh. Shot. Hey, he is starting to get into it, isn't he? Goodness me.
Hey, nice shot. Federer 3 2 now. Well, there you go. That is um, that is pretty emphatic, isn't it? Mm, this could be a chance. I'm taking two break points. Yeah, and there it is. A, a rather good return, wasn't it? So I'm just four points away now from another victory in the group stage and a clean sweep that's uh, been pretty good performance from us in this group stage I think Davidenko had his chances against us but uh, well what a pass that was from Federer Yeah, there you go. It's the longest rally in the match. 27 shots, that. Mm, that brings up match point, though. Nice. Beautiful backhand.
And stroked wide though, and here we go, second match point. Oh, what a shot! He somehow got it back. How? It's the quickest I've ever seen Federer run. He's done it again. There it is. Finally, we win the match. And that was a very, very strong performance. And Federer will be very disappointed, but um, he goes down in three straight sets. Six love, six three. Right, uh, time to head back to the main menu then and see who we will be playing in the semi final tomorrow. Um, we might well play both semi final and final. It depends who we're playing and, and how long the first match might be, but it's Rafael Nadal in the semi final. Let's see. Who's on the other side? Is that gonna? Does that mean it's? Uh, yeah, I assume Djokovic has won the. Um. Oh. Can we uh, look at the groups? Yes, we can look at the groups. So Federer must have lost to Davidenko. So Federer actually needed to win that last match, and he was just completely disinterested. But Davidenko gets through. And he will be playing Novak Djokovic, who won all three matches. Wow. I mean, he beat Andy Roddick 6-1. Six six That's insane. Wow. Okay, so David Denko is through, which means he's going to play Novak Djokovic. He did beat Novak in the, um, the World Tennis Finals. So it's uh, potentially a Nadal and Djokovic... Um, semi-final final lineup what it does do is uh, help us out with the rankings in terms of Roger uh, we should go above Roger Federer in the standings after this tournament no matter what so yeah hopefully you've enjoyed that if you have give it a big thumbs up down below subscribe for plenty more uh, top spin four videos and I hope you guys have a wonderful day thanks for watching and goodbye